I got the space hamster. All right. I think he was actually in my cab, in my uh, my crew quarters in the last. Okay, so Street needs Diana Beer or Diana Allen's Diana Beers. That's from freaking uh, Battlestar. And this is where Grunt. used to be. I'm not going to talk to you yet. Just going to look around, see if there's some stuff, maybe. I know you kind of have a middle of nowhere place, don't you? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Never mind. Okay, now I'll talk to you. How's your new assignment working out, Allers? Fairly normal, except for the unshackled AI, Matriarch Venezia's daughter, and the communicator that can reach Earth. The first two, I can deal with. That last one gets my attention. So what are you asking for, exactly? Anything from Earth is the lead story right now. That's not opinion, it's fact. Maybe I can pass on a few non-classified progress updates. Seriously? You just doubled my ratings. I don't need FaceTime, just a data upload. Tell people what's really happening on Earth. We need long recruiting lines on every planet after you air restored. I can do this, Commander. Remind me to tell you about the time I made an Elcor cry. <laughs> okay, so... Let's go see the engineer. There he is. Commander, welcome back to the Normandy. Or maybe you should be saying that to me. Engineer Adams, what are you doing here? I was put in charge of the drive core retrofits. My experience on the Normandy SR-1 made me an obvious choice. So, what do you think of our SR-2? She's incredible. There's one nice thing I can say about Cerberus, is that they know how to build a ship. And about that, Cerberus, I mean. I owe you an apology. How so? Back when you got this ship, Dr. Chalk was contacting me, asking me to help with your mission against the Collectors. I refused. I didn't have your back, and I'm sorry for that. Your alliance first. That's the way it should be. Thank you, Commander. Glad to be aboard. Is your family okay? My parents are serving on Viridian Zenith, an Alliance agricultural vessel. My sister is a navigator on the SSV Benjamin Davis. Happy to report that both vessels are safely under Hackett's command. Does the new Normandy stack up to the old SR-1? <laughs> stack up? It blows the old ship away. The Tantalus drive core has been completely overhauled. The SR-2 might be nearly twice the size, but the new drive core is three times bigger. This ship can fly. That said, Cerberus isn't too high on safety. If pushed past her limits, this core would vent into engineering. Guess it gives my team incentive to keep her well balanced during a firefight. Do your job or get vaporized. Pretty much. I noticed you upgraded the kinetic barriers with cyclonic technology. Should help reduce the draw when under missile fire. Hopefully that means fewer vaporized engineers. The IES stealth system is significantly oh, yeah. improved. We can, can handle a higher blue ship of our emissions. On the collectors. And that means... We should be able to drop out of FTL without triggering every sensor in range. Very handy for stealth reconnaissance. All in all, the Normandy is a marvel of engineering. What do you think of Edie? We had a good talk during the retrofit. A little strange at first, talking shop with an AI. AI? I thought Edie posed as a VI to keep the likes of you from unplugging her. Yeah, but I saw through her. Have you seen her hardware? <laughs> Processing power is off the charts. And then there were the problems yeah, that kept fixing that themselves. If hardware. I hadn't had her pegged, I would have sworn I was losing it. You never expressed any skepticism, Lieutenant Adams. I figured I'd better play it safe with the Cerberus AI, Edie. No offense. None taken. As long as you keep your fingers 
is that of my cognizance processors. <laughs> In the beginning, I tried disconnecting her from key processes without giving myself away. Easier said than done. But Joker seemed to trust her, and in time I saw her advantages. Even grew to like her. Carry on, Adams. Aye, aye, sir. Yep, she is a marvel of engineering, that's for sure. Okay, looks like it's time to go one deck below to the shuttle bay. It's always good to talk to all your crew. Keeps the morale in check. Ah, uh, what's up, little buddy? Good job. Weapon upgrades. Okay. Ah. Pardon me while I spend some cash. Okay, obviously I'm not going to be able to get everything. Holy shit. Obviously I'm not gonna be able to get everything off the start, but I'm gonna try. I could actually get sort of stuff. Let this tick off here. Personal touch. 